It is a great satisfaction to greet you again. I hope you and your pet are well. Today we will talk about the following. Penicillin for dogs. Uses, dosage, and side effects. Penicillin is a drug that has been widely used to treat various bacterial infections in dogs. It is derived from the fungus penicillium and works by inhibiting the synthesis of the bacterial cell wall, leading to the destruction of the bacteria. Here's what you should know about the uses, dosage, and side effects of penicillin in dogs. 1. Uses of Penicillin for Dogs Penicillin in dogs is primarily used to treat bacterial infections. It is especially effective against infections caused by gram-positive bacteria, such as Staphylococcus, Streptococcus, and Clostridium species, and some gram-negative bacteria. Some of the common conditions for which veterinarians may prescribe penicillin include respiratory infections, skin infections, urinary tract infections, gastrointestinal tract infections, ear infections, leptospirosis. It is also used in cases of septicemia and meningitis, among other conditions caused by microorganisms sensitive to penicillin. Additionally, veterinarians may prescribe the drug after surgeries to prevent possible infections. 2. Penicillin dosage for dogs. This is a guide to typical use of the drug in dogs and should not replace your veterinarian's advice for your individual pet. It can be administered in several forms, including injectable, into the muscle or vein, as an oral tablet, or as a liquid syrup. Oral versions are less commonly prescribed and should be taken on an empty stomach to enhance absorption, as food can interfere with this process. To prepare the syrup, dissolve the penicillin powder in water. Store this mixture in the refrigerator and use it within 14 days to ensure its effectiveness. Remember to store oral tablets and powders away from direct sunlight. Generally, the dosage ranges from 5 to 10 mg for every pound of the dog's body weight, administered every 12 hours. The length of treatment is usually 7 to 14 days. However, it can vary depending on the severity of the infection and your dog's response to the medication. Always complete the full course of antibiotics even if your pet appears to have recovered. This is because stopping the course early can lead to relapse or antibiotic resistance. It's important to note that penicillin, the oral form approved for use in humans, is not currently approved for veterinary use. However, in specific situations, veterinarians may prescribe certain medications approved for humans to animals. This practice is known as off-label use, meaning the medication is used in a way that is not specified on its official label. It's up to your veterinarian to decide if this medication is appropriate for your pet's condition. 3. Side Effects of Penicillin in Dogs Most dogs tolerate penicillin well. However, it's important to be aware of potential side effects such as vomiting, diarrhea, loss of appetite, bad breath, hair loss, swelling at the injection site, in the case of injectable forms, allergic reactions. In some cases, side effects such as gastrointestinal problems can be relieved by giving the medication with food. However, always check with your veterinarian before making any adjustments to how the medication is given. It is also important to note that not all dogs are suitable for penicillin treatment. Dogs with known allergies to penicillin or other antibiotics should not be given this medication. Also, special care is required when treating pregnant or nursing dogs with antibiotics. Penicillin can interact with certain medications, including some antibiotics, immunosuppressive drugs, and certain medications used to treat gout. Be sure to tell your veterinarian about any other medications your dog is taking to avoid adverse reactions. If you miss a dose of penicillin, you should generally give the dose as soon as you remember, unless it is almost time for the next dose. In that case, I recommend that you skip the missed dose and continue with your regular dosing schedule. Avoid giving your pet extra or double doses. It is a pleasure to inform you and help you, if you have not subscribed to the channel you should do it now, take care of yourself and your furry friend, a hug and until the next video.